G'day folks, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you what I use in my chicken coop to keep the flies at bay a little bit. Doesn't help a whole hell of a lot, but it keeps them down enough to get in there without being annoyed by them. Now this one that I'm using is the Buzz. I got it from Coles, but I have seen it cheaper at Bunnings Warehouse. Uh, they're about $5 a unit. I took the um, cover off one that I'm going to be using for the film and they have a little sort of a little sachet in there and uh, once it's watered, filled with water the sachet sort of disappears and you're just left with the, the bait that's in there um, it does take a few days to start to work but when it does start attracting the flies you, you'll see it fill up rather fast the last one I had only lasted about a week it says up to five weeks Four weeks, five weeks that um you can use them, but mine I just seem to throw away after about nine days. There was no use. Not really smelly. I have used some in the past that have been rather quite smelly. We smell them from the back of the property all the way up to the back of the house, which was about 30 meters away, and puts off rather a rank smell. But um, I'll show you what you need to do to um, set this up for the coop. So it says to add uh, about. 300 mils of water which is roughly about that much in the container but I fill it halfway or just under the, the nozzle here a few mil as that hangs from there they'll fly down anyway and they'll get trapped in there so as you can see I just lift the top off here it sort of comes out and um, I just fill that side up there as a bit of cold water and I'll fill it about out there as you can see it's rather quite full and you can see the little bag breaking apart inside there I don't know if you can see too good on the camera but if you give it a shake you can actually see it dissipate and mix in with it the little plastic bag seems to disappear fully and have like a sort of a yeasty kind of baker's smell to it but that'll go away in a few days and you'll just get the flies getting attracted to it so we'll go and um, hang this up in the back of the coop and I'll show you in about two or three days what, what it can do. So I just have a screw here on the edge of the coop. Um, just hanging up by this plastic that it comes with. Um, just hang it there. Let it do its thing. G'day folks. It's been 48 hours now and um, the fly trap's been hanging for 48 hours. So we're going to have a look at how much flies it's caught to this point already. Um, we did have sort of a little bit of bad weather yesterday so no rain but there weren't much flies around yesterday afternoon and this was just starting anyway so yeah, I'll show you how much it's got in it now. G'day folks, it's been another 48 hours since my last update uh, on the fly trap. Uh, just going to show you what it, what it looks like when it's semi full. A couple of flies going in there, hovering around. They really can't resist walking into it really. Um, so if there's anything else you'd like to see along these lines, the backyard farming or chickens, vegetables, which I'll be starting a new plot shortly. Um, just put it down in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you. 